Hey, Rumi, are you asleep? Oh, you can't sleep either? Is it because of the thunder? <laughs> Same. It's too loud and it keeps scaring me awake every time I start to drift off. Huh? Did I need something? Oh, <laughs> yeah, I was, um, just wondering if I could, <laughs> I don't know, maybe lay in bed with you? Why? Uh, you know what? Uh, never mind, actually. I I'll just go back to my room. Let's just forget about... Really? You'll let me sleep with you? Are you absolutely sure? I, I don't want to take up too much space in your bed or make you uncomfortable or anything like that. Get over there before you change your mind. <laughs> you don't have to tell me twice. Your bed is actually, like, ten times more comfy than mine. No wonder you're always in here asleep. Um, is it okay if we get a little bit closer and maybe snuggle up for a bit? Yeah, thank you so much. I really need it to be held by someone right now. You have no idea how much this means to me. Oh my gosh, you're so warm. One could even say you're pretty. Huh? <laughs> I didn't say anything. It, it must have been the thunder. Yeah, it was the thunder. Big, scary thunder. <laughs> it, um, didn't really hit me until now, but wow, we are so close to each other. I can practically see every feature of your face. Every perfect feature of your beautiful face. How can a human be so attractive in, in like a completely platonically friendly kind of way? Because we're friends. <laughs> Not anything more than that. You think I'm attractive too? Oh, come on. There's no need to lie. If anyone here is attractive, we both know that it's you. You really think I'm good looking? I'm sorry, it's just kind of hard for me to believe that because I've never really thought too highly of myself. <laughs> it's especially hard to believe coming from someone as perfect as you. Yes, you are perfect. Literally every single aspect about you is pure perfection. You have those beautiful eyes, those perfect eyebrows, an adorable nose, the most pinchable cheeks in the whole universe, and 
a pair of quite possibly the most amazing lips I have ever seen. <laughs> to be honest, if I wasn't your friend, I, I would like to, you know, kiss them. I'm sorry, did, did I just make things awkward? I didn't mean... Oh my god. Did that actually just happen? Why did you kiss me? I looked too cute not to kiss. I don't even know what to say to that. But I do know what I want to do now. <sighs> I was right. <laughs> well, I kind of knew that you would be an amazing kisser. Like I said, everything about you is absolutely perfect. Um, can I actually come clean about something? I, um... I'm not actually afraid of the thunderstorm. I actually had an ulterior motive to me. Well, you know, wanting to lay in bed with you. I wanted to take this chance to finally express my... Uh, feelings to you. We've been friends for years now, since like middle school, and now we're living together. I, I don't really know how to even begin to say this, so I guess I'm just gonna come right out and say it. I'm in love with you. I've been in love with you ever since I first became friends with you. I. I can't keep this to myself anymore. I need you to know how I feel. These past couple weeks, it's been getting too much for me and I just can't hold this in anymore. I want to be yours. I want to be able to go on dates with you. I want to kiss you whenever I feel like kissing you. I, I want to be your girlfriend. And I don't know what I expect from just coming right out and saying it. And if you don't feel the same, I promise I'll understand. You... You feel the same way? <laughs> I, I'm, I'm, I'm so happy right now, I don't even know what to say. I love you so much. You think we should get some sleep and talk about this more in the morning? <laughs> yeah, I can't get behind that. I'm so sleep deprived, I feel like I might just blab about everything I love about you. <laughs> Good night, my love. I can't wait to talk to you more in the morning. I'll miss you. <laughs>